Kevin from uh, Bethany, Ohio, are on with uh, Andrew Breitbart. What do you say? Yeah, oh, man, I tell you, what I think is I'm very nervous, so please forgive me for being stuttering a little bit. But when all those names he just named are people who have an agenda against the left, the left cares about people, the right cares about money. Now, you didn't say anything when George Bush was president of the United States and people were being arrested trying to protest outside of any meetings he ever had. People bring guns to Obama's meeting. They didn't get arrested, sir. The right is wrong. The left is right. And you people are so evil, it's unbelievable. You sit there and defend Michelle Bachman, Rush Limbaugh, Glenn Beck, Bill O'Reilly. They're all liars. And you are crazy. I tell you, this country has got me to where I don't like Republicans anymore. I won't associate with them. We're getting into a deep divide in this country because of the lies on the right and the left try to defend itself. Now, you, a C student, obviously. I'm sorry. I'm very, my hand is shaking. You got me so upset. Carla, let me jump in and get a response from our guest. Yes, that's the power of the media to create that perception that we're evil. I mean, how, how did I or Ron Silver uh, or Dennis Miller, what is it about we apostates, those who have who, gone from, there's no reason why a person who grew up in Brentwood, a, a, a secular liberal Jew like me, who, is, who was bathed in secular liberalism and the left and the fundamental default belief that liberals are the feeling good people, the, you know, and the Republicans are the evil people. I grew up with that perception. I grew up being told the people in flyover country are stupid. Why on God's green earth would Dennis Miller or me or any of these other people dare to go from one side to the other? It is, a, it is an act of conscience. Uh, it, it has hurt my social life. It has hurt familial relations because on the left, whether it be on a college campus, whether it be in Venezuela, whether it be in the Obama administration, these people cannot abide by people that disagree with them and they demonize them. And that person on, that, that, that just called trembling is a victim of the Democrat media complex. He has, been, he has been brainwashed to believe that Michelle Bachman, who raised five children and had 23 foster children, and that Sarah Palin, who lives up in Alaska, is somehow some evil monster. That those projections of the media onto conservatives to make me evil when all I want is the best for this country. Uh, what is a motive that I have? Do I want poor people not to eat? I've been accused of that by the Democrat media complex because of going after ACORN. 